en couture. Please be seated. Le président, veuillez vous asseoir. Reprise de The court is back in session. And before I hand the floor to the defense counsel to put the questions to this witness. La défense qui pourra interroger le témoin. The chamber will make an oral la ruling on the request by Nunti's defense regarding the practice concerning concernant a civil party to TCCP through 71. La de la de the trial chamber is of a request by the Nunti's defense for the reconsideration of certain practices for the examination of witnesses and civil parties. The Nunti defense submits de that this request is urgent due to the appearance of through TCCP through 7-1 before the trial chamber on Wednesday this week. Ce mercredi. The trial chamber will accordingly decide upon this request orally now va se with a written reasons to follow. Les motifs devant suivre par écrit. The Nunchi defense la objects to de three identify the practices. Trois One, pratiques. the practice of permitting witnesses to review prior statements before testifying and then to answer questions based on those statements. Sur le fondement des Two, déclarations. Deuxièmement, the Undue restriction of the scope of defense cross examination and three, unduly heavy reliance on civil party testimony. The trial chamber dismisses the Nunchi request. Full written reasons will follow as soon as possible. We now hand the floor délais. to Nunchi's defense to continue putting questions to this witness. You have the floor if you have any more questions. Maître uh, thank you, Cope. Mr. President. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Good afternoon, Mr. Chandler. Bon après-midi. I have a few more questions to you. Monsieur le témoin, j'ai encore quelques questions à vous poser. Um, first, some questions about your background. Votre histoire personnelle. After your study in medicine, vous avez étudié la médecine. You finished in Marseille. Je pense que vous avez obtenu un diplôme à Marseille en France. Après cela, vous êtes devenu radiologue. N'est-ce pas? I didn't uh, complete my uh, medical study Je in Marseille. In fact, in I went there to, uh, to help my friend Sunem to return to suis allé pour aider Cambodia. Mon frère, I concluded my study of, uh, at the Faculty of Medicine in Cambodia, not in France. De médecine au Cambodge, et non pas en France. But did Question. you become a radiologist in Phnom Penh after you came back to France? À Phnom Penh après votre retour de France? In Phnom Penh, I applied uh, for work at uh, three hospitals. Penh, One was uh, Calmet Hospital. À hôpitaux, à savoir l'hôpital Calmet. And uh, another one at uh, Bracket Millie for the maternity section Millier and for Okmai Sur Hospital, I applied uh, to work at, uh, for the uh, pediatric uh, section. Uh, section. Je me suis porté candidat pour le département so de in the, in the pédiatrie. The, the Question, uh, était-ce dans les années 60, avant le coup d'État contre l'ancien prince Sihanouk, à ce moment-là, étiez-vous ou non radiologue
réponse. For the radiology, I did a work there directly. But we could, je uh, n'ai pas we, travaillé we tout de suite comme radiologue. Through, uh, the frames and through, uh, make some analysis of the, uh, the system, we had to be familiar with uh, that section as well. Il fallait aussi avoir certaines qualifications dans ce domaine. Because the uh, the framed was not as clear as what we could see les in person in that uh, radiology section. N'était pas très clair. But just to make sure, Question. were you not working or were you working as a radiologist? Est-ce que vous avez travaillé, oui ou non, comme radiologue? Et est-ce que vous utilisiez la technique des rayons X dans les différents hôpitaux du Cambodge dans les années 60? Please uh, repeat your question. Réponse. Pourriez-vous répéter The question is very simple. Question. Were you La question est simple. Avez-vous travaillé comme radiologue dans différents hôpitaux du Cambodge dans les années 60 et est-ce que vous utilisiez les rayons X Réponse. I already said that I comme je l'ai dit, specialized in general Uh, treatment. Je suis généraliste. And at the Calmet, actually, I applied for the ICU à section. Calmet, j'ai proposé mes services au service des soins intensifs. At that time, it was not a military hospital like what it is now. Un hôpital militaire comme aujourd'hui. And uh, for that section, I uh, for dans that hospital, -là, I was involved in the maternity section. J'ai travaillé donc à la maternité. J'ai aussi présenté ma candidature à un je ne pouvais travailler qu'une heure par jour dans chacun des mentioned. hôpitaux que j'ai cités. L'hôpital de la mité khmero soviétique par exemple. Question. Étiez-vous, oui ou non, radiologue Ma question est simple. Réponse. I was not uh, an expert in je pas uh, radiology. Expert de la radiology. Um, Mr. Witness, Question, um, you said Monsieur le témoin, aujourd'hui, vous avez dit avoir participé um, à l'exhumation uh, de restes humains, de squelettes de prisonniers you à Kran Tachan. Um, vous avez cité un chiffre, celui de 12 000 crânes qui auraient été retrouvés. Au cours des dernières années, vous êtes-vous rendu à Kran Tachan et plus précisément, est-ce que vous avez vu un stupa contenant des crânes à Kran Tachan Not only I saw it, the stupa that contains the skeleton remains was the result of my appeals through some excellencies, through those whose relatives died there, so that the stupa could be built with their assistance and contribution. Would you be able to tell if the 12,000 skulls that you were speaking of are roughly about the same amount as the skulls that you can see nowadays at uh, the stupa at Grand Tachan? Are these the same amount, the same number? I already stated Réponse. before the court that the skulls, uh, some of them lost from the day that we exhumed them and stored them near the pits. Initially, we stored at the house, and in exchange, we gave them 100 kilograms of rice. 
but later on uh, some wild dogs came uh, to uh, uh, eat those scales and when we move it to, an, uh, to the stew pan, some got lost again. Initially there were 1,132 uh, scales that we exhumed. Would you be able to tell us roughly how many skulls are now being held in that stupa? Et combien de crânes y a-t-il à présent dans le stupa? The skulls uh, stored in the stupa are uh, less than the registered number on the list due to the reasons I mentioned earlier. Relatives of those évoqué, victims uh, prayed in the hope that they would reach out their hands to touch the, the, the right scars of their relative who could be their husband or dear father or mother or sister. So a few scars disappeared each day as those relatives took them to their respective home. Would you be able to tell us how many of those skulls got lost? How many skulls are there remaining now in that stupa? Would you be able to tell us? I have not done the uh, re-estimation and I worked with the chief man in Tramcourt district and all of the monks in the 56 pagodas in the Tramcourt district and when we counted before we placed those scouts into the stupa, uh, the remaining scouts were 12,013. Et euh, à ce moment-là, le décompte était de 12 013 crânes. Pour ce qui est des vêtements, certains ont pu être identifiés par les However, proches des victimes. We did not keep those as Mais the nous n'avons pas gardé ces vêtements, car ils étaient souillés. Et pour les vêtements de les vêtements, young children in, uh, that ex were exhumed from the North Pit. Des crânes de, de jeunes enfants ont été exhumés de la fosse Nord. Russell there. And I observed during my 29 detention, uh, I saw lots of uh, children there. De vu and uh, later on when we exhumed, we couldn't find or Mais couldn't see those uh, children's skulls. Mr. Witness, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm going to cut you short a little bit. Um, Question. By just putting to you that um, Reprenons. there are about 1,500 to 2,000 skulls in that stupa, would that be a fair uh, estimate or am I uh, completely off? Actuelle, il y a entre 1,500 et 2,000 crânes dans le stupa. Est-ce que cette estimation sera plus ou moins correcte? President, uh, witness, please wait. Le président, veuillez and attendre un the instant, Monsieur le Président. Et le député international co-prosecuteur, uh, tu as le floor. Uh, Your Honor, I object to the question on the grounds that counsel is testifying. I'll rephrase. Um, Je soulève une objection car la défense dépose elle-même. Presently, the stupa contains between 1,500 and 2,000 skulls. Peut-on dire qu'il y a à l'heure actuelle 1500 à 2000 crânes dans le stupa we counted the skulls together with the monks, and there were a total of 10,013 skulls, says the witness. However, I cannot say for sure how many skulls were requested and taken from the stupa by the, their relatives. And uh, some of the tools that we exhumed were stolen or taken away by children. Mr. Witness, um, uh, were you aware that Krang Tachan used to be 
Let me rephrase. Do you Question. know that, that the location where Krang Tachan is situated, situated used to be a gravesite? Que là où se trouvait Krang Tachan auparavant se trouvait un I cimetière. Mean, a graveyard where people buried their uh, family members. Le reste de l'intervention de la défense est inaudible pour l'interprète. President, the international co-prosecutor, you uh, can proceed. La parole est au co international. Your Honor, if that fact is in evidence in this case, we'd appreciate a citation uh, to it. And if counsel is relying on some other document, uh, we'd also appreciate si la uh, a citation to that. Il faudrait que ces documents soient cités. I would appreciate if counsel uh, knows this the case file before objecting because il faudra que l'accusation reconnaisse bien le dossier avant de soulever des objections et les documents que je cite ont été versés au dossier il y en a deux place being a grave site before et il est dit dans ce document que il y a un cimetière auparavant je parle du document so my question, Mr. D, Witness, are you aware that 8, the, si the location where Krang Tachan was uh, is situated used to be a gravesite? Donc, pouvez-vous répondre à ma question, s'il vous plaît? Uh, and allow me to elaborate a bit further on uh, that word. Krang Tachan refers to a plantation field owned by Tachan. It was not a, a grave uh, It was not a graveyard, as you stated. It was a plantation owned by Tachan. But I'm not making it up, and I refer uh, all parties in the trial chamber to E3-262. Je vous renvoie 2062, au document E3 uh, and I quote, 2062, uh, ERN English 0031, sorry, 0031363, Krang Ta Chan used to be a completely quiet forest and a stupa to preserve the remains of the ancestors of the people in that place. And I'm reading uh, from a report a brief history of the Krang Tachan genocide, a genocidal Pol Pot in Sari So my question again, was it, is it true that Krang Tachan used to be a grave site? Krang Tachan était-il donc, oui ou non, un cimetière? Please uh, bear in mind that Usually, a, a large forest is a quiet forest, and not only that, it could be a grave, a yard, a grave site. And the chant made that forest into a, a plantation because of the uh, quiet uh, area or location. It was not a, a, a graveyard. I in fact inquired, uh, made inquiry about that. Je me suis renseigné. Now the reason I'm asking, Mr. Witness, is because it were a grave uh, site. Je vous pose la question, Monsieur le Témoin, parce que s'il si s'agissait d'un cimetière avant les années 70, what would be the proceedings to make sure that skulls that you found were in fact uh, skulls belonging to former si prisoners? Pour pouvoir vérifier si les ossements que vous avez trouvés appartenaient ou non aux anciens prisonniers. Question, Mr. Et je poursuis. And that is the following. Um, when you joined the revolution in 1970, um, do you remember names of fellow revolutionaries you met in that period between 1970 and 1975? <coughs> From 1970 to 1975, and until today, we lost our friends. We we were separated from one another, and for that, I made 
Nous avons perdu beaucoup d'appels to the chamber to expedite the trial proceedings. And not only the accused or the civil parties or witnesses are getting uh, much, much older. As for me, my real age is 80 years old. President interrupts, Mr. Witness, you are obligated to respond to the uh, question. As for other matters, the chamber will deal with them. And it is uh, for you to listen to the uh, question and make an appropriate response to that question. And limit your response just to the nature of the question rather than to make a detailed response outside uh, the nature of the uh, question. And please uh, try to recompose yourself and concentrate on uh, the uh, question. As in, there's a saying goes in our uh, Khmer culture, answer what is asked of you. À votre and limit, limit your response to the nature of uh, the question being put to you. I will um, reformulate my question to make it easier for you. Did you, La Défense, in those years between 1970 and 1975, uh, meet revolutionaries like Hu uh, Yun, Tune Tune, 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 for example, you, Tune Tune? Were, you, were you together with them um, in that period? Ou d'autres, comme Onim également. I did not live with Hu Yun or Hu Nam. Je ne vivais pas avec Hu Nam. As for Chun Chun, Doctor Chun Chun, I met him at Dam Nat Snul. Je l'ai rencontré à Dam Nat Snul. I didn't ask whether you lived with Hu Nam or Hu Yun, but were you fellow revolutionaries? Question. Je ne vous ai pas demandé si vous viviez avec ces personnes, mais bien si c'était des co-révolutionnaires, par exemple. Euh, pour ce qui est du médecin Tion euh, In 1970, we all left Phnom Penh together. Phnom Penh However, upon arrival, we were separated and put at, different, uh, put at a different location. And I was uh, put at Dam Nat Snul, which is currently in uh, Chum Kiri. In Kampo province, province, as Dr. Chun Chun, he, he was uh, transferred to the north zone, and I did not know the uh, location where he was transferred to. My question was: Were you? Did you consider yourself a, a, a revolutionary, a Khmer Rouge revolutionary, in the in the period between 70 and 75? I considered myself as the, the, the chief servant of the uh, Khmer Rouge regime, that je, is, of the Democratic Kampuchea regime, regime, and not a revolutionary. Were you active as a doctor on the front lines, helping Khmer Rouge cadres who were wounded in battle? Uh, Étiez-vous sur le front en tant que médecin? Étiez-vous là pour uh, penser les blessures des soldats? In my capacity as a doctor, I did not discriminate uh, médecin, the patient that I treated. Pas fait de Even for an animal, we would uh, treat any animal. And we, as doctors, considered ourselves animaux. not enemy to any uh, party or any uh, anyone. Party, party. Again, Mr. Withers, that was not my question. My question, question. was, well, ma question were you la... active on the battlefield assisting si medically Khmer Rouge cadres si who were wounded in battle fighting on all soldiers? We were there, so we 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 had to provide our help in uh, in the treatment in the way that we could. Well, I put it to you; it's quite a difference Question. whether you are a doctor in uh, a hospital in Phnom Penh or whether you were in fact a medical uh, expert assisting Khmer Rouge forces in the battle. 
against Lon Nol soldiers. So my question is, were you a medic, a revolutionary, very instrumental in the war of liberation? If you have been active in the war of liberation. I did not uh, consider Réponse. myself instrumental through the Khmer Rouge regime. Je I still pas consider myself as a medic who would rescue or médecin, gives treatment to anything or anyone, regardless of their race or, or background. À, à quiconque, hein, de son witness, please don't try to circumvent the answer. Question. My question to you is, you are a doctor. Question. My question to you is very simple. Were Je ne vous ai pas demandé si vous étiez médecin. Helping the Khmer Rouge Je vous ai demandé in si in vous aviez aidé les Khmer Rouges alors qu'ils luttaient pour la libération. When they were in Je vous ai demandé si vous apportiez les soins nécessaires aux soldats Khmer Rouges qui étaient sur le front. Yes, I did. Réponse, oui, je l'ai fait. If I were not what would it mean to be a doctor? Si je ne l'avais pas fait, à quoi cela aurait-il rimé d'être médecin? My next question is: the reason of your arrest all of a sudden? All of a sudden, somewhere in March, April 1975, you were arrested. Tout à coup, en mars 1975, vous avez été arrêté. Can you tell us the reasons why you think you were arrested? Pourriez-vous nous dire pour quelles raisons, à votre avis, vous avez été arrêté? I do not know the reasons. I think you have Réponse. to ask uh, the, the people who arrested me. Je ne sais pas pourquoi j'ai été arrêté. Il faut I didn't know what mistakes I made. Je ne sais pas quelles More than 10,000 people who were detained at Kanta Chan complained that they didn't know the, the mistakes that they made. Regardless of that, they were arrested and tortured by the Khmer Rouge. So what is put it to you that is not correct? You were a doctor, Question. you were a revolutionary, and all of a sudden, in April, May, 1975, you were arrested. I'm sure people who arrested you told you why they arrested you, didn't they? Or did they not? Why were you arrested? I didn't do it. You asked the same question, and I actually already replied to that question. You asked the same question, and I already replied to that question. I pondered that issue. I pondered why. I was arrested. Je demandais pourquoi j'avais été arrêté. Mr. President, Le interrupt. Uh, Mr. Witness, Monsieur le the question is not uh, what you said. If you know the reason for your arrest, please say so. If là. not, si you also pourquoi, should, stay, uh, should state uh, so. Did the Khmer Rouge tell you what mistakes or offenses you made? That led to your arrest. I have reminded you repeatedly to listen to the questions carefully and limit your responses to the questions rather than to make a long response Je vous ai demandé de ne pas donner de and uh, lead to uh, confusing or lead to other questions to be put to you again and again. The chamber doesn't want that kind of response. We only wants the response that give weight to the our uh, to the bench consideration. On veut prendre en compte ce que vous disent les juges, je vous prie. So again, you tell us Question. some reason. You must have heard some reason. Maître Coppe. Why they arrested you? Monsieur le témoin, donc à nouveau, vous devez très certainement avoir eu connaissance d'une raison ou de plusieurs raisons pour laquelle vous, révolutionnaire, médecin, vous avez été soudainement arrêté. I didn't know what offenses I made. Je ne savais pas quelles erreurs j'avais commises. It's not very clear exactly when you were arrested, but. Les if circonstances autour de votre arrestation sont encore March, obscures, particulièrement February, la date, apparemment c'était mars, uh, peut-être février uh, 1975. Um, 
as we all know here, uh, 17 April 1975 is a very important date. Comme tout le monde le sait ici, uh, avril 1975, c'est une date très importante. On the day of liberation. Étiez-vous encore en prison le were jour de la libération? Were you released just before the day of liberation, or were you released just, just after the day of liberation? liberation ou juste après le jour de la, li de la libération? Witness, I was taken out of Grand Tachan 14 days after the liberation. Was the deliberation in 1975? It, it, it happened 14 days after that date. So it's your testimony now that you were released on the 1st of May 1975. Donc vous affirmez que vous avez été libéré le 1er mai 1975. Witness. It does seems like that. Oui, quelque part par là. The liberation was on 15 April, say the witness. La libération a eu lieu le 15 avril, dit le témoin. So I was released Donc, after the 15th of April. Après le I was avril. released from Krang Tachan because le I saw many people who were uh, transferred from Phnom Penh and I also saw uh, some people who were evacuated from Phnom Penh uh, were sent to uh, Krang Tachan. You, are, you must be a little confused with dates because it's Maître difficult Coco. for 17 April people to arrive already on the 15th of April in Difficile pour les personnes qui ont été libérées le 10, qui ont été évacuées le 17 avril d'arriver le 15 avril. C'est donc un peu confus. Object. L'accusation, objection. Okay. The president, le um, prosecutor, you may proceed your objection. The witness didn't say that 17 April people arrived in Krang Taichan on 15 April. I'm also confused by the answers of the witness, Mr. President, so I'll move on. Again, Mr. Witness, because it's very important for me to understand. How many days after the liberation que vous avez été libéré de Krang Tachan. Witness. Réponse. The liberation of the whole country. La libération de tout it le pays. It was on the 17th April. A eu lieu le 17 After avril. the 17th April. More than 10 days after that, I was released from Krang Tachan because I saw a Phnom Penh evacuee arrive in Krang Tachan when I arrived in uh, Wat Champa Temple. I saw uh, people also there and they were also sent out from that pagoda. You were not able to, to give. Uh, testimony as to the reason why you were arrested, but vous n'avez pas pu nous expliquer pour quel motif vous avez été arrêté. Mais pourriez-vous nous dire quelles questions vous ont été um, posées by, pendant que uh, your fellow Khmer Rouge cadres? Par les autres cadres. Witness. I I'm interested in two things. The first one, they were whispering that any person who belonged to the Sino case should not be kept and would be sent to re-education or uh, sent for uh, smashing. The second thing, um, the intellectual and the petty bourgeoisie was the uh, part of the uh, revisionist. Uh, they should uh, not keep. This is uh, what I know. But Mr. Witness, you were a revolutionary. You joined the Maquis. La défense, mais Monsieur le témoin, vous étiez vous-même révolutionnaire. Vous avez pris le Maquis. Ce ne sont certainement pas là des choses que l'on vous a dites, puisque vous vous battiez à leur côté. Vous aidiez les soldats. 
peut-être même exactly the sur le plan médical. Dites-moi donc quelles questions vous ont été posées. Witness. Le témoin. Your question is uh, focused on Krang Tachan or any Vous other offices uh, in which I work? To me. Just give me a few, just paraphrase a few questions that were asked to you by your fellow former Khmer Rouge cadres. Pourriez-vous nous dire ce que vous disiez les autres cadres Khmer Rouge? Um, President, um, um, the command translation is not uh, complete. We, can, we could not understand uh, your question. Uh, Mr. Kope, could you uh, repeat your question? And uh, the chamber did not get an idea what your question means. So uh, could you please uh, rephrase? My question is again Coppe, uh, about nouveau. the questions that were asked to you les by vous your ont été posées par vos uh, fellow Khmer Rouge cadres. What particular questions anywhere in Krang Tachan or anywhere else did they ask you? Posées? À Krang Tachan ou ailleurs, quelles questions vous ont-ils posées Que soupçonnaient-ils à votre sujet Pourquoi vous ont-ils arrêté Aviez-vous fait quelque chose Vous accusaient-ils de quelque chose en particulier Pourriez-vous m'en dire plus Witness, in Krang Tachan office, they insisted and questioned me who came to, to, to train you in CIA network or KGB networks or, or association. I refused saying that, no, I don't know. I don't know what CIA and KGB uh, was at the time. Maître Coppeux, pourriez-vous être plus précis Pourquoi pouvait-il penser que vous apparteniez à un réseau du CIA ou du KG, de la CIA ou du KGB Est-ce qu'ils vous ont demandé des noms, des réunions, quoi que ce soit qui serait plus spécifique Donnez-nous davantage de détails. Witness. I did not know what was my uh, mistake or offense. I could not realize uh, those uh, network because I had Je never attended any training with CIA or KGB training. If uh, they asked me about a medical training, I uh, could respond. Um, Mr. President, uh, Mr. Oui, Coppe, you may continue um, your question. Mr. Witness, did they ask you to write a, conf a confession? Est-ce que l'on vous a demandé d'écrire une confession? Witness, no, uh, they didn't order me to write any confession. I'm, I'm, I'm puzzled, Mr. Witness. I will, I will tell you. Monsieur um, le témoin, je suis perplexe, you are très honnêtement. Of Tamok, vous êtes un bon ami de Tamok. C'est ce que j'ai cru comprendre. Vous êtes un vrai révolutionnaire. Et nous sommes à quelques you jours arrested, de la révolution. For Et four weeks. soudainement, vous êtes arrêté, vous êtes mis en détention pendant quatre semaines. Et vous ne vous souvenez d'aucune question to, qui to, vous aurait été posée. Et on ne vous a pas demandé de Mr. mettre Witness, par écrit des aveux. Monsieur le témoin, je pense que vous n'avez jamais été arrêté et vous n'avez jamais correct? été mis en détention à Krang Tachan ou ailleurs. Est-ce que c'est correct Witness. I understand that your understanding is not correct. 
you say that I was not arrested, but I was arrested. I have a better understanding than yours. I know uh, myself very well, so you are not me. Uh, President, it seemed to me to the chamber that uh, you have no uh, more further question to put to this question. And uh, so your last question seemed to be um, you are seeking for a conclusion, and this is uh, prohibited by the rules. So, um, she was a, a young Nous parler prisoner together with you at Krang Tachang. Witness, uh, Madame Kao Samad, is this the one you refer to, Councillor? Yes, she was, she was a fellow oui, prisoner during those weeks with you at Kramtachan, is that correct? correct? Respond, yes, Kao Samad was uh, brought there when she was uh, about 13 or 14 years old, but uh, she was sent there because her relatives were arrested and sent for execution in different places, and uh, she was arrested and sent there. So what um, is your next question on Kao Samad? Ma question serait de savoir s'il est toujours en vie. Witness. Le témoin. After I left uh, the place in 1979, je suis I met her twice. Je it was Par more than 20 years now. I have never met her. Uh, when I met her for the first time, she, she was a, a teacher for the uh, preschool, but I never met her since then. I'm not entirely sure Notre if Coppe. I understand Je ne suis pas sûr bien votre réponse. Je you saw her Maybe in 79 or after Donc, 79? Or après when was the last time? Maybe I will ask you like this. When was the revu. last time you Je saw pose her? Ma question ainsi. Quand est-ce que vous l'avez vue pour la dernière fois? Witness. Le témoin. I did not take note the date when I saw her, je I met her. Je n'ai pas pris note de la dernière fois. But uh, it was not an important uh, meeting. Date. So I uh, do not recall the date. Ce n'était pas une réunion uh, très now. importante, c'est pourquoi je ne me rappelle well, pas la date. Just a few years ago maybe or was Maître it Coppe, was it 20 years ago? Or 30 years ago? 20 ans, il y a 30 ans. Witness, my last Réponse. meeting uh, with her, la it was more than uh, 20 years now. It was in 1979 1970 and now 2015. Is it? Maître Coppe. Um, what, what more can you tell us about this, uh, this woman? Au sujet um, de cette femme? Que pouvez-vous nous dire d'autre au sujet de cette femme? Are you and her the sole survivors of Krang Tachan, or are there any other survivors that you know of Krang Tachan? Krang Tachan? savez vous s'il y a d'autres survivants? Witness, uh, Krang Tachan office 
was established in 1972 and operating until the 7th January 1979. It was operating for a long period of time and my time there was only 29 days only. So how could I know uh, the survivor um, it's only uh, the you or the researcher uh, uh, would know uh, how many survivors from that office. Told anybody that you and her à qui que ce soit que vous and et elle êtes les deux seuls survivants de Krang Tachan. Witness, I did not Réponse. tell anyone uh, here before the court, I je did not say that uh, I was the only survivor, but I can say I am the survivor Par from contre, that je peux office. Que je suis un de Mr. Witness, do you know a book Maître called Coppe. War and Genocide, a never-ending cycle of human brutality, qui uh, written by a person called uh, Zhang Tachai? Fin de la brutalité humaine, écrit par Zhang Tachai? Objection, Your Honor. L'accusation. Objection. Homework Council. President, uh, hold on, witness. Uh, the co prosecutor, you may proceed. To the best of my knowledge, that question is based on a document that hasn't been noticed. For this witness. Ce document n'a pas été rajouté au dossier pour ce témoin. Corrigez-moi si je me trompe. Réponse de Maître Copper, à nouveau, vous faites vos devoirs. Accusation, ce n'est pas une réponse acceptable. Le document a été rajouté au dossier pour ce témoin ou ne l'a pas été. Maître Copper, mais ça ne veut pas dire que le livre n'existe pas. Donc ma question, à nouveau, est la suivante. Connaissez-vous ce livre The president, uh, president witness, uh, um, she don't need to respond Monsieur to the last question. Pas tenu de à cette question. Mr. Witness, have you ever Maître written Coppe. an article for a magazine Monsieur called Searching for Justice, Searching for Truth? Vous écrit un article yeah. dans le journal Searching for Truth, uh, cher à la enquête de vérité, l'accusation, objection. Again, I'm asking something. Maître Coppe, à nouveau, je pose I'm une referring. question sur ce qu'a fait le témoin. Mr. President, so um, uh, the chamber would like La to hear your objection. Votre objection. Uh, Monsieur le prosecution, could vous you indicate your objection with the ground and uh, your full objection? Uh, we, we wish to hear, we wish to hear uh, in the public hearing. Ici, en publique, so ce que vous avez it's uh, à dire. difficult for the chamber to follow Il if you exchange too quickly like that without the uh, authorization from uh, the chamber. Yes, Your Honor. Uh, My understanding of the rule regarding questioning witnesses based on documents is that any question founded on a document should be noticed to the other parties, and that if a question is founded on another document that has not been noticed to the other parties, it's not admissible. The last two documents that counsel has referred to have not been noticed to the other parties, and therefore those questions are in our submission and admissible. Mr. President, I'm not referring to a document. I'm asking for a question whether this has written something. De demander si like it, le témoin it, a écrit un article. Alors, je sais que ça ne vous plaît pas, mais c'est mon devoir que de poser cette question. Le président, le président, le what is your document Maître, that you refer to, the books, the title, and um, Mr. Coppé, could you indicate the title and uh, the type livre? document you are referring to? De quoi s'agit-il? I, I haven't actually reached that, that stage yet. Je étais pas um, encore là. My, my question first, and I would like the witness to answer that general question, question whether he has ever written something, que le témoin either in a chapter a of a book or from a magazine, or a chapitre d'un livre, soit un article pour le magazine à la recherche de la vérité. Je ne lui montre pas de document à ce stade. Je lui pose une question, et je pense avoir le droit de le faire. Whether you like it or not. Que cela vous plaise ou non.
the president, uh, Mr. Kope, because in the interpretation has not been as good as you did in the question. So if uh, you uh, ask the open question, uh, you are entitled to do so, but um, the chamber advised you that you uh, should um, uh, uh, conduct your uh, way of questioning in a proper way, acceptable uh, before the Vous chamber. I will rephrase a little bit. La défense. Mr. Je vais Mr. Reformuler. Mr. Witness, you, in the first quarter of 2013, write an article about the experience in a magazine called un article dans la revue à la recherche de la vérité concernant votre expérience du Cambodia démocratique. Witness, I did not write any article in any book at all. Are you sure, Mr. Question. En êtes-vous bien certain, Monsieur le témoin? Witness, yes, it Réponse. is clear. Tout à fait sûr. Question. Mr. Witness, who is Pen Sovan? Monsieur le témoin, qui est Pen Sovan? Witness, I don't know Pen Sovan. Je ne I just saw his face on a photo on television. Even though he television. was from the same province, même si I don't know him. De la même province que moi, je ne le connais pas. So Question. Mr. Pen Sovan never intervened Et donc, on your behalf when Monsieur you were threatened to be arrested post 79. N'a jamais intercédé en votre faveur alors que vous craignez d'être arrêté après 1979. The president, the, président, the witness, uh, do not need to respond to the last question because question. Uh, the witness indicated that uh, fait, he doesn't dit, know Mr. Pensovan, uh, Mr. Coupe. Um, it appears that uh, your time is uh, over and um, the chamber hand over the floor to Mr. Kong Somon. So... Uh, it is noted that your uh, line of questioning, uh, the last one, uh, seem to be uh, do not help the chamber to ascertain ne the truth. Pas propice Mr. Kung Sum On, you may proceed. Kung Sum On, Kung -Sum -on uh, good afternoon, mm -hmm. Mr. President, your honors, and Merci, uh, the witness. Uh, Mr. President, before I put uh, questions, I would like to ask for uh, the chamber's leave. Uh, to use uh, document D, uh, 118 uh, slash uh, 24, uh, the document filed by the co-prosecutor's office. And the response, I understand the um, practice of uh, using uh, this document because um, the witness uh, will be the one who uh, will respond. Uh, we need to you uh, to give the uh, document to the witness. Court Je officer is instructed to uh, take the document to witness for examination. Kung Sam On, because uh, there's a uh, a problem we could not uh, make a uh, copy for other Nous parties, so we would like to ask that the prosecutor, if you have a copy, should provide to other parties. President, uh, co-prosecutor, do you have uh, copies of this document for other parties? No, Your Honor. The, the only copy I have is extensively marked. J'ai un seul exemplaire et il y a de nombreuses annotations dessus.
Um, Mr. President, th this document has been put on case An file two as E319.1.5. Ce document a aussi été versé au dossier sous la cote E319.1.5. Pourquoi donc faudrait-il remettre un exemplaire de ce document Je ne comprends pas. Council, Kung Sam On, Mr. President, I would like to respond to the co-prosecutor. E3, one nine point one point two. We could not access this document on the system. Thank you. Mr. President, uh, Mr. Co-Prosecutor, do you have a copy? Prosecutor, uh, yes, we do have this document. Um, we can provide this document to the witness for examination. Court officer is instructed to give this doc to hand over this document to the witness for examination. Le président veuillez remettre ce document au témoin. La défense. Defense counsel, so witness, could you uh, look at? Page number four, moi, the last page, which uh, bear page. the name Kao Chandra, um, and tell Chandra. the court if uh, this is your name and your uh, thumbprint on that document. Is your name and your digital thumbprint that we see in this document? Witness, yes, this is my um, uh, my name and my uh, thumbprint was uh, appearing on this page. Defense counsel uh, for the court record, uh, this document, D hundred eighteen slash twenty four. This is the minute of the court. Uh, Office of Co-Investigating Church in uh, February 20th, uh, 2013 at uh, 10 a.m. 5 minutes at uh, Mohasena Village, Tapem Commune, Tramcock, uh, District Takeo Province. Uh, witness, do you uh, recognize that this is the minute of interview that you gave to the uh, OCIJ? President, uh, witness, hold on. Witness, Yes, Le this document, oui. I signed my signature on it. Ma signature sur ce document. Defense counsel, uh, could you uh, confirm again? Uh, it, it was not your signature, it was your thumbprint. So could you uh, indicate this uh, Il me semble again que to ce the court? Pas votre signature, mais bien votre empreinte digitale. Pourriez-vous confirmer? Witness, yes, uh, this is my uh, thumbprint on the paper. Defense counsel, have you read or anyone uh, read to you uh, before you uh, put your thumbprint on this document? Yes, Response. Sometimes. Um, uh, a person uh, read to me and I listened and I uh, recognized uh, the accurate, accurate uh, statement and certain uh, error I uh, do not recognize on this uh, PV. Counsel, thank you. Uh, so could you uh, look at uh, respond to question 17 on uh, your uh, the document in your hand uh, on answer 17. So let me put a question to you. Question. 
je vais Did you know about the mistreatment of the Khmer Crown response? Eu connaissance de cas uh, de response 17. Maltraité. Et ensuite la réponse Let 17. Let me quote. Que je cite. I did not know about that. I je just heard from other people that the Khmer Rouge troops gens uh, attacked les to uh, take back the Kampuchea Kram territory. I was detained at Krang Tachan 5 and uh, late 1974 and another uh, fin Sundays in 1975. And later I was released and I was uh, made uh, to work as a, a mechanic to, do, to repair machine. So my question is for you is that uh, were you detained at Krang Tachan in late 1974 or early 1975 or you uh, stand by your earlier response before the court that uh, you were uh, detained uh, March or April in 1975. The president, uh, witness, please hold on. Witness, uh, it is unclear from this document that that uh, detention was in 1974, but in fact it was in March 1975 and early uh, April of that year. But he is not uh, correct when uh, I read and it say 1974 because I was detained placé en détention uh, at a time in the verge of the uh, liberation in April. So uh, between um, April and Donc, vers le mois uh, Yes, um, March and April. It was to total of 29 days. Au total, été Council, été placé en can you tell jours. the Question. court the difference between the two? Uh, you indicated uh, two dates. different years. It was one, 1974, Mais and another 74, year in 1975. And uh, the number of days of your it, detention was the same, and now you uh, indicated uh, two different months, um, Mar March and April. So what can you say about uh, the difference here? Response, uh, the difference uh, of uh, the two months, because my calculation um, was uh, 20 tw 29 days, but jours. I'm not so sure about uh, the month. I asked my wife and my children, ma um, uh, they said I left and sent left the family and was sent to Krang de Chan. It was uh, 10 days before the liberation of Phnom Penh. And also, I was detained there 10 days after the liberation of Phnom Penh. From uh, late of uh, March and of March early of uh, April. April. In total, uh, I was detained uh, 29 days and another five days at Krabai uh, Prey. Council, thank you. So a while ago, I heard from you that Defense count, um, the president, defense council, do you have many more questions? Council, I have many more questions, Mr. President. President, um, witness. Le président. Um, the day after tomorrow, uh, can you come to uh, testify to conclude your testimony before the trial chamber? Witness. No, I cannot uh, say now for sure because my health is uh, precarious. I have a problem uh, with my leg. Sometimes I cannot jambes. walk after sitting for Parfois, long. I cannot confirm the president because um, the chamber need you to give testify um, 
for another hours to conclude uh, to respond to the different council. So uh, you said that you cannot uh, predict um, so unless uh, there is an emergency. So uh, the chamber uh, uh, things that uh, you can come to give Sauf and conclude your testimony on Wednesday um, uh, this week um, uh, on the 4th. Uh, this week. Uh, Mr. Kyle Chandra, uh, thank you uh, for uh, your time. Uh, your testimony has not come to a conclusion. Uh, the Chamber advise you to come to finish your testimony uh, from Wednesday, the 4th February 2015. Uh, you are now excused, and uh, court officer, uh, please work with the witness support section to facilitate um, the witness transport home and to bring him back uh, on the 4th um, February 2015 before 9 a.m. in the morning. And uh, the trial chamber wishes to inform the parties that um, we uh, will adjourn for today's uh, proceeding and the hearing uh, will resume on Wednesday, the 4th of February 2015 um, at 9 a.m. And on Wednesday, uh, the trial chamber, um, after finishing the testimony of Kalchandara, La fin de la déposition de um, the Tri Chamber um, uh, will hear the testimony of two TCCP 271. Um, security personnel are instructed to bring the accused to the detention facility and uh, bring uh, them back to uh, the courtroom uh, on uh, the 4th of February 2015 before 9 a.m. in the morning. The court is adjourned.